Hi guys, good morning to you all. Um, I want to do a, a little video which is a little bit different than anyone that I've ever done before on this channel. As you know, everything that I talk about is about Chelsea FC. But this particular one, I'm going to talk to you about my daughter, my four-year-old daughter, Imogen Chelsea, and um, what she's doing for a charity and uh, I've never in five years ever asked for a penny from anyone, despite the fact that at many, many, many occasions, I won't lie, I've, I've needed it, but I've continued to do whatever I've had to do because of that reason. And I'm not asking for anything that anyone hasn't got or whatever, because I know times are really, really tough right now. But just want to kind of make you aware of this. My daughter, she's four years of age, and uh, she's doing something for charity. It's, uh, it's the Little Princess Trust. And what the Little Princess Trust do is... Um, well, I'll read you out the, the post that I put up on Facebook. Um, I went... Because she's started to raise quite a bit of money. And she's about 50% or 60% there now um, from her actual target. But uh, I'll put a massive thank you to everyone. Because I put it on the Chelsea FW6 Facebook group. Again, it's the first time I've ever done anything like this. But I want to kind of... If I can if I can support my daughter as much as possible because I think she's amazing um, and I'm really really proud of her um, a massive thank you to everyone that's donated so far to my daughter's fundraising activity and much love for all uh, you beautiful people with beautiful souls she's doing uh, for, for charity a sponsored haircut for the Prince's Trust and uh, she has so far raised well, at this time it said 222 quid, but it's well over 340 odd quid. And I think she's got about 60, 70 quid in cash donations too. Um, now what she's doing, guys, is she's cutting off 13 inches off her hair. It's, her hair is quite long and she's been growing it and been really proud of it. But she decided to cut it. Um, and I'll give you an idea. Um... Today, just to let you know, the Princess Trust has also recognised what my daughter is doing. Called her a little star, and that's really buzzed her up, and her school as well, and neighbours around the area. So it's all really, really positive stuff. But what my daughter said in her own words, I want to help children that are poorly and have pretty hair again. Um, and the reason for that is what the Princess Trust do is they organise wigs, free wigs, for children and adults that have gone through the trauma of alopecia and cancer where they lose their hair and uh, and they feel really embarrassed and everything and I'll show you a little picture of her that's the advert that she's got at the moment I don't know if you can see that guys that's my daughter that's how long her hair is and um, yeah, I'll get you that picture there look that's my daughter with the old clippers and uh, that's how long her hair is she's been growing it since day dot she's never had it cut ever before and this is the Little Princess Trust. As I say, they recognised her yesterday. Put a little message saying, you little star. So, she, as I say, that's her there with a little caption which says, I'm cutting and donating my hair to fundraise money for... So she's donating her hair for little, the Little Princess Trust because I want to help children who are poorly to have pretty hair again. And uh, I think that's pretty pretty spectacular guys and I was just wondering you know if any of you out there would be kind enough to sponsor her even if it's 50 pence if you haven't got the money I completely understand it because times are really really tough right now I know that more than anything trust me guys life's a struggle but you've got to do what you've got to do but if I can help you know it's a good cause a really really good cause you know children you can't imagine the trauma losing their hair etc just to show you guys where she's up to at the moment She's trying to raise 500 quid, and at the moment she's raised on the app, which is the, the, the link, she's raising 300, so far 332 quid. Um, that's 60% there, but as I say, she's got about 65 pounds worth of cash donations. Um, and here's a story, guys. When a child loses their hair to cancer or another condition, the Little Princess Trust is there to offer a free, real hair wig to help restore their confidence and their identity. The charity also funds childhood cancer research, seeking to find kinder and more effective treatments. If you want to check out their web address, guys, it's 
Little Princess Trust, that's Little and Princesses dot uh, org dot uk to find out how you can help um, the LPT and give young people back what cancer takes away. Uh, the Little Princess Trust relies solely on the efforts of enthusiastic community fundraisers um, as they receive no formal funding. It's all legitimate, guys. What I'll do for anyone that wants to donate, even spon just sponsor, you know, um, 50p, pound, you know, it, it's 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 not, you know, I, I listen, I appreciate everything, and my daughter does too, yeah, and uh, we're going to do a video when uh, she, she has her hair cut, you know, and everything else, because, you know, it's all about transparency and honesty. Uh, I want to thank some of the people from Chelsea SW6 on the Facebook group, um, Johnson Bristol, Nathan, £10, £20 respectively, Heath, £5, there's an anonymous one there for tenner, another anonymous for a fiver, Danny Murphy, £10, he paid the £2.50 gift aid, which you don't have to do guys, but it's helpful, Charlie Driver, who's from a company, £50, he, he did plus £12.50 gift aid, wow, incredible, thank you Charlie. Uh, Chris McCarthy, £20 plus £5 gift aid. Uh, Jordan, £5. Stacey Rose, £5. Matt, £50. Anonymous, £5. Grandma, and Alan, that's obviously here. Grandma, £40 quid plus the £10 gift aid. Another one from Anonymous, £5. Another Anonymous, £5. Tim Moulton, thank you, mate. £5 plus the gift aid. £25 quid from Pamela Doors. £5 Anonymous again. Anthony S. Jansen, £10. Mohammed, thank you very much, buddy. Um, five pound plus the gift aid. Paul Hilson, ten pound plus two pound fifty gift aid. Steve, well we all know Steve. Five pound anonymous again, ten pound. Five pound from Nicole and five pound from Zoe. Thank you very much. Obviously, with the money that we put forward as well, plus uh, the other bits and pieces, there's another sixty-five, seventy odd quid to be added to that. So she's doing really, really well. And needless to say, guys. I am extremely proud of her. So, so proud of her. Yeah, she's four years of age and, you know, it's a big deal. It's a big deal for any girl to cut their hair. And I do love her hair, to be fair. I, I must have been. I was like, wow. I love her hair. You know, it's just, I don't know, just something. I just love the fact. I love her long hair. Do you know what I mean? But she's doing it. And, uh, you know, I'm proud of her and she's doing it for the right reasons. But I shall put the link down below, guys much love to you all thank you so much to anyone that's um contributing and um just I, I, you know i can't thank you enough guys you know what i mean and uh and and i'm also thanking you from my wife uh kelly and uh my family but more importantly imogen chelsea Rolf. cheers guys appreciate it much love and I'll put a video up later and it will be about Chelsea but up with Chelsea